Dodgers hosting the Nationals, and the Nationals are plus 200 on the money line. The Dodgers are minus 250, over under, nine runs. Nationals getting a run and a half on the run line are plus 100, meaning if you bet them that way and they win this game outright, you win. They lose by one, you win. Dodgers laying a run and a half on the run line are minus 120, meaning if you bet them that way, they have to win by two. And the wind is blowing out towards right center at 11.4 miles per hour. Just food for thought for those people who want to bet the over under. Now, head to head, the road team is eight and two. The Dodgers are seven and three. The Dodgers are the favorite is seven and three on the money line. The favorite winning these games by two runs or more, laying a run and a half is seven and three. There's only been one one run game in their last ten. The under is six and four in their last ten, and the under nine is six and four in their last ten. Williams pitched once against the Dodgers. It was last year. It was as a member of the Mets. Five innings, two runs, two earned. They won that game five to four in ten innings, and that was in LA. Miller is the Dodgers rookie phenom. He's only pitched once so far. It was against the Braves. The Dodgers are 1-0 in that game. Five innings pitched, five strikeouts. That's his stat line right above me because that's all he's done so far this year. And their last handful of games that they played against each other, the Dodgers won the last one 7-1. And then before that, the Nationals were actually on a three-game winning streak because for a while, I believe the Dodgers were like 10-0 against the Nationals. They just didn't lose to them. So they won the last game 7-1. The Nationals won the game before that 8-3. The Nationals won the game before that 4-1, and the Nationals won the game before that one nothing. And their last handful of games overall, the Nationals are 2-2 two two in their last four, and they are 5-5 five five in their last 10. 14 runs, 22 runs, 6 runs, and 5 runs. 6 runs and a loss, 12 runs and a win, 4 runs and a win, 2 runs in a loss. The Dodgers are 1-3 and three in their last four, and 4-6 four and six in their last 10. 7 runs, 12 runs, 11 runs, 22 runs. 3 runs and a loss, 3 runs and a loss, 6 runs and a win, 10 runs and a loss. Granted, they were playing much tougher opponents in the Braves and in the, the Rays. And the Nationals were playing the Royals and the Padres. So, food for thought. Dodgers with the money line, Dodgers laying the runs. And I'm going to go over just because of the way that the wind is blowing. I think it may favor the bat the Dodgers batters. These are just my picks. If you disagree, please go with your gut and please bet responsibly.